Go. This weekend, the competition was here, and it was on the velodrome, and there was uh, some phenomenal rides by a lot of a lot of athletes. Anytime you come out here, and people are starting to talk about uh, tenths and hundredths, uh, differentiating uh, the riders, that that's a great success. We have a uh, half a dozen guys here that are that are all podium potential at world championships, and so you come to a national championship race. And you might, you might place better, worse in a national championship race than you would at Worlds because the competition is so stiff. Me, for the women, me and Greta, just we kept knocking heads the whole time. It was awesome that we're able to ride that competitively and yet still we're good friends and remain teammates. So it's awesome to see and be able to do that. Today it was nice. It was, um, it was pretty tame conditions and the wind wasn't aggressive. The, it was a little thick, but for conditions, it was way better than we had on for the pursuit. The race the yesterday is very much a race about pacing and, and riding steady and uh, maintaining an effort. But with a headwind, you have to punch it into the wind, and then you have to float it a little bit um, when you come into the into the tailwind section. So it, it's it's harder for some than it is for others. You know, some great competition out here this year. I think last year uh, we had national championships, and a lot of people didn't underperformed and this year it seems like everybody overperformed so uh, to walk away with three podiums is uh, a good, good feeling. It just speaks well to the coaching, speaks well to the training that's gone this far and I think it's, uh, it's always nice to have those reminders that you're, you're meeting goals and achieving, achieving what you want to be achieving.